Johnny, get your gun, get your gun, get your gun. Take it on the run, on the run, on the run. Hear them calling you and me. Every son of liberty. Hurry right away, no delay, go today. Make your daddy glad to Hello, and welcome to the channel. We're over here in beautiful eastern Washington today. We'll be doing some expansion testing. Specifically, we're going to be testing some Barnes TSX BT rounds. Now these are a 78 grain monolithic, all copper bullet, and we've got these loaded up for our Mark 12 Mod O. We'll be running these from 1 to 400 yards, so let's begin. And there's our 100 yard 78 grain Barnes TSX. Here's our Barnes 78 grain TSX at 200 yards. And there's our Barnes 78 grader at 300 yards. Here we have our Barnes 78 grain TSX at 400. All right, so just a quick caveat with this round before we get started. The 78 grain offering from Barnes in their TSX lineup is really not designed for 223. It's designed primarily for 224 Valkyrie. Um, and in fact, it's not recommended to be loaded into 223. So, we decided to try it out anyway, um, but to get it to load properly, we had to set the overall length of the round much deeper into the case than uh, we otherwise would. And the result was um, a definitely decreased velocity at the muzzle. We had around 2580 feet per second. Um, and as you can see, looking at the expansion of these rounds, that's just not quite enough to really allow these rounds to reach their full potential. Although, you know, we did get decent expansion at the 100 yards, but the expansion that we got at the 100 yards is what I'd expect to see at the 400 yards if we'd used a round that uh, was properly weighted for this chambering. So that's something we're going to definitely try out in the future. We'll uh, get our hands on some lighter rounds in the TSX lineup and then retest those. So at the 100, uh, decent expansion, um, pedals opened up uniformly. Even with the low velocity across all four rounds, um, there was very uniform expansion, which is something I've sort of come to expect from Barnes in the past. Again, same at the 200. 
Not much else to say other than very uniform expansion. That continues at the 300, but we can really see here that it's barely expanding at all. And again, that goes to it being uh, too heavy of a round for this chamber and really uh, too long and not having enough steam. At the 400, even even at the 400, still decent expansion. So looking at our graphs here, for expansion on the left, we can see that at the 100, the barns opened up 1.8 times its original size, 1.7, 1.4, and then 1.4 again. And this is pretty impressive considering that the 78 grain, again, is meant for the 224 Valkyrie and is not designed to be ran in um, a 223. Especially considering how deep we had to set the bullet into the case to actually get it the rounds to uh, load into a magazine. Weight retention was excellent across all ranges fired at the 2, 3, and 400 even with expanding to 1.7, 1.4, and 1.4 again respectively times its original diameter, it retained its you know exact starting weight. Average expansion across all ranges fired is 1.6 times. Um, the weight standard deviation and the expansion standard deviation are both very low. Uh, great round. Looking forward to trying some lighter bullets in this lineup. If you've enjoyed today's content, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe, and thank you for watching.